Hello everyone, Julie here from www.forgetmenots.publishmystories.com Well, today's been another research day. So I've been to Ikea as a destination shop. I've been on Amazon destination website. So today I went to Tubney Retail Park. It, Tubney Retail Park has a Dunelms, it has the range, uh, it has home bargains, uh, all shops that you go to if you need something. Are they destination shops? Now this is interesting because I would say that they're not destination shops. The range might be home bargains you go into just because you're there and you might need something. And in fact, I went into home bargains and asked for something, spoke to one of the assistants because I couldn't find it. And I just go round and round in circles and the woman who I was asking had no idea what I was talking about. Just for reference, it was cheesy bits. You know, those little tiny biscuits that you can have. They do them in different flavours. Cheese, salt vinegar and cheese and chives. But she had no idea about the stock that she was holding. And in fact, I got so frustrated in the end, I just walked out. Because I, I just couldn't bear talking to her anymore about something that she should know about that she didn't know. So Home Bargains is certainly not a destination shop. It's a, oh, well, I'm here, I'll pop in place. Dunelms, I needed something. So I actually went into Dunelms for a particular reason. Uh, unfortunately, their stock wasn't any good, so I didn't buy anything. And as I was there, I also popped into the range. Now, the range has been a destination place before, but their stock isn't up to much. And you know what? There are no customer services people around if you want to ask for help. Nothing. You just walk around the shop and you and you very rarely see anybody else other than customers. So day two on trying to discover what a destination point is for a customer. Am I any further forward? No. I know that I want something. In this instance, I'm actually trying to redo my bathroom. So in this instance, was Dunelms a destination shop? Absolutely, it was. I wanted something. Did they provide me with a service? No. Did I go into any other shops while I was there? Absolutely. Did they provide me with a service? No. Would I go back to those shops just because it's those shops? No, not at all. Not at all. So what is a destination shop? It is something or a draw for a customer to go in and make a special journey. Dunelms was that because they provide home furnishings. But on this instance, it, it, it wasn't and I wouldn't go back. It, it just wasn't as useful. So what have I learned today about destination shops? Everything that I went through today, I did not have an enjoyable experience. So having an experience is what's important. I want to go in and I want to enjoy my time in the shop. I want to be able to go in and speak to somebody. I want to get some ideas about what's going on. And I got none of that. In these shops, I was literally left on my own to wander around. If I bought something, so what? If I didn't, so what? They, they really weren't interested. It's more getting numbers in than actually creating an experience. Going over to Ikea is very much a destination. They want me to have a good time. In fact, they don't even want me to think. They want me to think about the rooms that they've created so I can go, oh yes, I can put that in my house. The other shops today, not at all. Left my own devices. They had a lot of stock in there and they had a lot of prices they wanted you to buy but I'm not made to feel special. I was a number, just a body in. So learning point, in some shops, some organisations, some businesses, you are just a number. Do I like being a number? No, not at all. I want to be made to feel special. I want them to give me an idea of how my life could be, of how buying a product or service will make my home mine and make it special. Didn't get that today. Got it at Ikea. Didn't get it today. So a destination 
shop, a destination or website has to make somebody feel special. They have to make them feel that they are the only person in the world and that you are offering them something that they need. Oh, interesting, isn't it? Have you been to any shops recently? What did you feel? Were you made to feel welcome? And what about the websites that you visited? Are they destination websites or you just happened, to, happened upon them? My name is Julie Farmer from www.forgetmenot.publishmystories.com. Thank you very much.